The hospitality program at IPFW is giving students real work experience outside the classroom. They're required to run a fully functioning restaurant. And this year, that's Dopio Zero Rustic Italian Cuisine. Here to tell us more, we've got Ashley and we've also got uh, Rebecca and Jordan in this morning. Thanks so, so much for coming in this morning, bright and early. And let's talk about this. Uh, this is a really interesting concept. So why is this all, why is this happening? This is a operations management program that IPFW, well now Purdue University, has decided to offer its HTM students. So we pretty much have to get together within five weeks and open a restaurant uh, that is our own concept, theme, menu. We have to do our own purchasing. And Dopio Zero, I want to talk a little bit about the name too. How did you come up with that? It is a double zero, which is a grade of flower. We, it is run on a scale of two, one, zero, and double zero, which is the finest grade of flower. Okay. Um, <laughs> Jordan and Rebecca could tell you a little bit more about the flour. They actually homemade yep. the noodles and bread yeah. and yeah. pasta. And Jordan and Rebecca, you brought in some, some cool stuff here. Yeah. Looks like what, cannolis here? Yeah. So what are we going to be doing this morning? Um, we're going to be filling a couple cannolis for you and serving our potato, sausage, and kale soup. Ooh, okay. So go ahead and show us how we fill some of these cannolis. And while we're doing that, I want to talk about, you know, what's your experience been in the program so far? Um, I mean, we've learned a lot. Um, we basically just, like, try to keep the food costs below the 32% mark. Okay. Um, we've learned to make our, like, I've never made pasta before, so we've learned how to make, learned how to make pasta. pasta. So. Cool. Um, what, talk about some of the other daily operations that you go through um, as part of this experience. Mm, um, well, on Mondays, we get together and we see what food we need to order. So we order that. And then Wednesdays, we prep most of the pasta, all of the doughs, um, and the sauces. And then Thursday mornings, we go in at 7.30 and then just make the soups and then make all the bread and stuff. It cooks. truly is a full-time job. Mm -hmm. yeah. right. It's giving you that real-world experience, yeah. too. Yeah. And you've, you said you brought in some yeah. soup? It's a creamy Italian sausage potato kale soup. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Do you get to come up with your own recipes, or how does that all work as part of this experience? Yeah, we basically just decided on the menu ourselves. Like, we looked up Italian, like, authentic Italian foods and just decided, like, we, um, like, the first weeks we just cooked, decided which ones we wanted, like we tasted. Cool. Yeah. So while they cooked, then the front of the house, we had to yeah. come up with like the decor and mm -hmm. rearranging the restaurant theme and the menu design. Great. So it was a collaborative yeah. And I want to get you too, if you could maybe yeah. dish us out some, because I don't think the folks at home can see the soup, <laughs> but it looks delicious. <laughs> and, and while you're doing that, we've got these cannolis, very artistically done. Might have to snack on those in between uh, commercials here. But if folks want to actually check out this restaurant, they can, right? Yes, it is inside the Holiday Inn off of Coliseum Road here okay. in Fort Wayne. Uh, we changed the Mastodon Grill each Thursday from 11.30 to 1.30 p.m. Okay, so not only do they get the real world, world experience of running a restaurant, but I mean, it's actually open. People can come yes. and check this out. Yes, we have to make real revenue and real food costs. And Very cool. We have to hit our objectives. Well, congratulations on all that you're doing. Good luck with everything and running the restaurant. And thank you so much for coming in early. If you want to check out uh, Dopio Zero Rustic Italian Cuisine, there's the hours there, there on your screen. You can also call the number and check that out at the Holiday Inn off Coliseum. We'll be right back.